Hi guys, it's Debbie and I'm going to work on an acrylic painting today. Um, I'm going to <laughs> repaint this one. Um, parts of it I liked, but other parts of it I didn't like. You know, I just couldn't get it. You know, there's little areas I liked. I loved a lot of things about it, but I just didn't feel like um, that it was worth um, keeping. <laughs> so, um, I am going to um, pause this painting and put a quick coat of black painting on it. Black paint, Liquitex painting, and <clears throat> do a, a, a poured painting on there and see see how that turns out. Anyways, I hope you guys are having a great day and um, and trying to do some of these paintings or getting your kids involved because it's definitely a lot of fun. <laughs> Anyways, I'm gonna pull you down. Okay, got. It. Okay, guys. Um, in this one, I quickly did that. I'm just going to put a little black on the edges. This paint was a little thinner because I'm using some pretty thick. That black is pretty thick. So I add a little touch of water to it. I've not added anything else. No, no silicone to the black. Now there is silicone mixed in to the color stuff if it hasn't been poured off on something but um, I don't think you need a whole lot anyway sometimes all right so here we go and this is I'm just gonna set over there for a minute while we um, I you know I'm kind of thinking like um, blues and yellow this time let's see how that works uh, Oh, you know what? And I don't want too much dark. So, because we're painting on black. So, a lot of white in there is going to be fine. Mixed in. A little bit of blue. I might encase that in the white a little bit. <laughs> um, now, you can visualize what these are going to turn out like. And I don't know how many of you guys managed to get it. They turn out exactly like what you're visualizing, but I never have. Ooh, did you see that little bit of clear stuff came out? That would have been the silicone. So this is going to have some silicone in it. Just so you know. <laughs> and I'm just going to do a little touch of orange. That's it. Now, if I need more paint... I will mix up some more. All right. I'm going to keep it to one side if possible. And then, <clears throat> now, I think what I'm going to do this time is just give the surface a little spray where I'm going to go. We'll see how that works. That's just water. And I want to pull this. Gonna push you back a little bit. Oh no, forward. I think I need to take you up some so you can see the whole thing. Okay, there you go. I forgot. I thought I had checked that. Oh, I guess I didn't. Okay, guys, so now I'm just gonna let little bits out. I'm mean, gonna, I only wanna do one side of this because that's just my plan. Look at that, how that, that one part turned out pretty cool, didn't it? There's a lot of color that has escaped right now, so I'm not trying to lift too much. Now I'm painting with the cup. There's nothing underneath it except for what I'm picking up and dragging now. So what I plan on doing is when I get this done is coming back. See now, I really do like that part. And better than the rest of this. You guys see what I like? All of that? So what I'm going to do is huh, I'm going to do 
I mean, I'm sure that's going to turn out, but I'm just going to basically scrape off what I don't like. Put a little more black on there. We can leave that part alone. And, um, let me grab some black, put it in my cup. And let me get some water. Okay, guys. <clears throat> I didn't plan on that or else I'd have had more stuff ready right here for more black ready to go. Probably got this a little thin. I really like what's happening here and I didn't like the rest of that so why not right <laughs> why not start over again let's who knows we may not get anything like that before I can't even remember what order I put this on on the canvas so oops I don't know where it's getting that white from must be from left behind well, that'll be okay, because by the time we get done dragging everything through here, who knows what we're... Okay. So now, we're going to do uh, same colors, I hope. So orange, orange, yellow. I don't... Honestly, can't remember what color I did. Did I put a little deep blue on there? Oh, well. Start with some yellow. I don't see any deep blue in there, do you guys? I can't remember if I put any on, but it won't matter because I'll just do a little touch right now with some white because it's so dark, remember? If you do dark colors, it's going to all look really dark. And we see teal. I have all these colors mixed up next to me because I'm one of those people who, who change their mind. All right, so... Maybe a little more yellow this time. And white. Okay. So, I'm just going to try to stand it up a little bit. There we go. I still like that part the best. <laughs> but at least we're getting a little bit over here. And you know, you guys, the thing about this is if you want to come back, you can do just what I did. I mean, because because I'm trying to make a video out of this. Um, I, I could be here all day working on those colors. So, and all you guys got to do is keep scraping off. So I'm not touching anything over here because I'm really happy with that. And what I might do, though, is try to stretch it out over in there. So I don't know how much is left in here now. If there's there was some left. I wanted to get it over here, some more over in here. There's a bunch pouring off right in here, so I'm gonna let it pour onto my spatula. Try to capture some of that color for this side. It's never done till you say it's done, right? <laughs> okay, so now what am 
am I going to do? I don't even know. <laughs> this might be one of those videos I have to trash because um because I keep playing with it until it's done. That's the thing with these bigger ones. For me, it takes a while and um it's hard for me to do a video on it because then I want to play with it and play with it and play with it until it's got something that I'm in love with. So the littler paintings are easy for me to make a video from. Okay, so this, I kind of want to, I want to touch some of this over into here. Kind of feel we need a little connection out that way over in here. So what I'm going to do is see if I can oh, get out from underneath there. I don't want it straight across. I mean, I'm not trying to divide it. I'm just trying to give the eye a place to go to and take a break. <laughs> very important on these big paintings. Very, very important. Oops. Now, any of the stuff in the black that I don't like, when it gets done, what I can do is come back and you know what I almost kind of like a little action adding on into here like that's not I kind of like that so I might just try to do a little more of that just a little some little lines I don't know if I like that big one. Oops. <laughs> oops, oops, oops. So, I'm going to look for something clean to stick that up with. Just in the black. I can always come back and repaint that part. So... think so far, hmm? Just gonna have a little water over in here. You guys, I'm almost done. I mean, I'm just, I'm pretty happy with this, I gotta tell you. Yeah, I think I'm done. I want to make sure you guys, I'm trying to figure out there if I hold it more over that way. Can you see it all? I'm gonna bring it up just a little bit. Anyways, that's it. I really, really thank you guys for stopping by. And um, let me know if you have any ideas that might be pretty cool to do. Thank you. Bye-bye.